it's very nice to meet you again uh, here in Belarus. Please um, introduce yourself to our viewers who uh, do not know you yet. Well, the pleasure is all on my side. I'm very happy to come back uh, after the first visit in December uh, when we saw the Unibike running. Uh, my name is Dorothea Jäger. Uh, I'm coming from Switzerland. I discovered about a year ago at uh, it could be called random, but I think it's like destiny. The image uh, of uh, a uni uh, bus running in some Facebook uh, page. And I said, I have to research this. This is the future of transportation. I was ignited by this spark of genius that the inventor has uh, put into this image. So I researched and finally came to uh, find out that Skyway Technologies was located in Belarus and I took contact with Kirill and then it all started. My friend, um, uh, business friend Rajvinder uh, Singh, uh, with whom I shared this image and to whom I said I think India could be a final market and a very great potential, he also was of the same opinion. And what we did is he proposed it to the Honorable Minister, whom he knows well, in Himacho, and that's how it all started. We had then a meeting in September last year in Moscow in your office, organized uh, by Kirill with Anatoly Yunitsky and Kirill. And then we started the projection, and now we are here with the delegation from Darmshala. In the meantime, rather little time has passed. And Speaking of Kirill, you mean Kirill Badulin, uh, yes. chief of the uh, 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 chief of department. Yes, of correct, correct. Technology so he was our first uh, contact uh, person, and uh, in a very high speed, the high speed which you will reach once you build your intercity uh, lines. That was somehow the. Um, yeah, the spirit which uh, was uh, injected into that business development for India, because as you or as you probably have already told your public, um, in India you have not only been developing uh, the Darmshala project, visited, made a site visit, developed the project, and now very close before closing, uh, you have also with, been visited. Um, different other locations and there will be a very nice technology park in Jharkhand where thank goodness we were also able to introduce to you the right um, contacts and the right local partners so Sorry. Um, uh, thank you um, uh, now well you say that uh, you were first ignited by the Skyway technology having seen the uh, images of uh, the Unibus uh, and some pages of Facebook exactly, or whatever. Correct. Now, what do you feel having seen the Unibus running with your own eyes today in the Eco Techno Park? I, I must tell you that already when I saw that first image, I knew this is not just uh, a concept design. This is a reality, which soon will be realized and visitable I just, I just knew it, you know, you see many images, there are many uh, concept designs uh, of many different technologies and ideas, and uh, we are, our company, Castor Consult uh, uh, from Switzerland, uh, is specialized in uh, transportation uh, system promotion, so we are kind of have some background knowledge, and I knew this is the technology. This is really something which differentiates itself radically from everything else that is in the market. It is absolutely, I could even imagine that this could be uh, a way of entertainment in the future. People say, let's go Skyway, you know? Not only for trans pure transportation, just for fun also. Passing an, an afternoon, having a, a nice experience. So this is really, really uh, cool what, what uh, was possible today. And I'm very grateful that how do you assess the prospectives of this um, project of uh, Skyway building that track in India, uh, whether it will uh, uh, be implemented uh, or not, and 
if it happens, when will it happen? Well, I mean, I was myself very much surprised at the speed of reception that the, lo the authorities, the local authorities, showed towards Skyway technology. But it has to do also with um, a, the need uh, in India to solve their infrastructure transportation problem, which is aggravated, and um, also the open-mindedness, I think, towards um, avant-garde technologies, which you find in India. Uh, they, they are very, very open to uh, exploring uh, such proposals and understand, and since we have uh, educational background, especially of the of the younger um, officials that understand that have a science background. Many of them have a high level of scientific understanding because that's how they were uh, taught in their school career. So it is a very open mind, a very big open mindedness towards innovation. And I mean now also the fact that um, the smart city concept has been launched. Uh, that is the right moment. It's really the technology meets the historical moment and the need of the market. So it is an ideal constellation and India is the place where you can implement that. Definitely. I mean, as we saw, we have also the reactions. We have in different, pla uh, in different districts where we talked with authorities. They were just waiting to experiment what we experimented today. Come, sit, write, understand and sign. And it's all due to you. Thank you, Dorothea, for no, no, no. for your effort <laughs> that you've been the starting point of the project and on behalf of all our uh, supporters, investors, uh, I am here to thank you uh, with all my heart. Well, it is my pleasure because I understood the vision, the visionary's um, goal and the market which was waiting for such a vision to be implemented. So I'm really just a gateway. I don't take any honor for that. Please. Uh, thank you once again and to success yes, together. Yes, yes, absolutely. As you, as I heard several times, Skyway or no way. Exactly. <laughs>